Now let's move on to talk about load balancing. Load balancing is a key blocker for digital transformation. If we look at some of the drivers for digital transformation, they are time to market, modern applications, and cost efficiency. There are increased IT, IT demands for a number of applications, number of changes, and number of environments and infrastructure. Traditional hardware load balancers remain a blocker due to the challenges of not being scalable, not agile, and not flexible. You can modernize your load balancing infrastructure with Avi. The legacy load balance architecture has the challenges of box-by-box -box configurations, fixed scale, and lacks visibility. Modern load balancer architecture decouples the control and data planes and provide the benefits of centralized policy and configurations, scale out of the data plane, and end-to-end -end application visibility. Avi does this with the two main components, the controller, which is the management and control plane, and service engines, uh, which is the data plane. And this helps lead this helps to lead to a 10x reduction in managed appliances. Here we see an IDC business value study on Avi load balancer. For day two operations, there's a 90% scale to capacity. For operational expenses, there's a 43% reduction in OPEX. And for application developers, there's 27% higher productivity. Next, we'll go over the cloud operating model with Avi load balancing. You can deploy new applications in VIPs in minutes instead of weeks. It is built for automation, self-service, and auto scale, and leads to reduced tickets. It provides faster troubleshooting with end-to-end -end visibility across the network, server and applications, and allows faster root cause analysis. Unshackle yourself from the biggest load balance related technical debt, eye rolls. Um, this allows you to have no more complex, error-prone, hard to troubleshoot TCL script writing. Avi provides holistic and detailed application build visibility to simplify troubleshooting. It provides an application health score for each app with performance, resource penalty, anomaly penalty, and security penalty. And this allows you to quickly see all of your apps in a single view for a quick look at the overall health. Avi provides end-to-end -end latency information. It gives you visibility into the client RTT, server RTT, the application response time, and data transfer time. It provides this information on a graph, allowing you to quickly look for spikes or anomalies in the data. Avi also provides failure causes. You can proactively discover top reasons for application failures in one single window to reduce mean time to repair. Here's a list of Avi use cases and ecosystems showing it's a universal solution. We are focusing on the on-prem private cloud use case with VCF and NSX, but you can see that there are many use cases for Avi. Here we see the product capabilities of Avi. For app services, it provides local traffic management, global traffic management, application security and WAF, and container ingress services. For software-defined platform, it provides central management for orchestration, elasticity for adaptive capacity management, resilience with high availability and self-healing, and automation and self-service.